Hi, in the previous video we learned about uh, taxonomic categories. What are uh, with simple examples man and mango? In this video we go details about uh, taxonomic categories. What what is the species and what are the with uh, different species examples something like that, genus, family, order, and all those things. Uh, for example, if you see this uh, like uh, species, what is a species? You need to uh, ask that question because that is very very important. It is a group of individual organisms with fundamental similarities. That is important. For example, if you include a group of organisms, if you say this is one species, this is one species. How you because they are having fundamental similarities. This is very very important. It is a group, no doubt. We call a group as a species. Okay, that is uh, with similarities. Close related species. There are again, there are. For example, if you take uh, uh, two groups like this, this is one species. This is one species. We place different species. There are clear morphological differences. There are clear morphological characters which differentiate from one species to another species. Because uh, if you take the example. Solanum melangena, Solanum nigrum, Solanum tuberosum. These are uh, same genus but different species. This is uh, a different species. This is different species. This is different species. But all three belong to same genus Solanum. Solanum. So these three different species are differentiated based on. Uh, morphological characters eggplant black nightshade potato these three belongs to the same genus but three different species in the same way panthera leo lion panthera tigris tiger these belong to the these are two different species but belong to the same genus panthera same uh, genus See, this is different species. This is different species. You need to understand that clearly. What is a species? It is a group of individual organisms with fundamental similarities, and uh, different species come under same genus because of uh, clear morphological differences. Examples are Solanum melangena, Solanum nigrum, Solanum tuberosum. These three are different species but belong to the same genus Solanum. Panthera leo lion and Panthera tigris are two different species, but same genus Panthera. That you need to understand. This comes very very important. These are comes in bit form. Uh, for example, uh, identify the organism, identify the species which does not belong to Solanum genus, something like that. So try to understand. And the next thing is uh, like genus. What is genus? It is above the. It is next to the species. So close related species combinedly called a genus. Close related combinedly called genus. It is closely related a species. It's a group. Tags are rank in a taxonomy hierarchy, which co constituted by a group of related species. Example. You have seen in the previous slide, potato, tomato, brinjal. These are different species, but belong to the same genus Solanum. That is important. Different species, different species, but genus is one. Why? It is a genus is a combination of different species, different species. The, like lion, leopard, tiger. These are different species, but same genus Panthera. You need try to understand from complete exams point of view the these uh, scientific names: lion, panthera, leo, leopard, panthera, pardus, tiger, panthera, tigris. These scientific names are important from competitive exams point of view. From uh, IP exams point of view, try to understand the entire concept. Next uh, thing is uh, like family. What is a family? It is a related. Uh, Group of related genera. A group of related genera. If you see this, for example, 
group of related species makes genus genus makes family this is important genus makes a combination of genus two three genus more than a group of genus combinedly called a uh, family example solanaceae solanaceae includes different genus like uh, solanum petunia datura these are different genus but they include under family solanaceae three different genus belong to the same family because of the some similar morphological how on what basis we will combine these things based on some morphological and reproductive characters what are all those things we will study in taxonomy in detail when you go to taxonomy chapter we study detail what are the um, similar uh, morphological and reproductive characters morphological and reproductive characters now just you remember one thing solanaceae is a family which includes solanum petunia datura three different genus at the same time from animal point of view animals Felidae is a family which includes Panthera genus and Felis genus. Panthera includes lion, tiger, leopard. Felis includes cats. These are two different genera but belong to the same family Felidae. I hope you understood uh, what is a uh, family. What is a species? What is a genus? What is a family? This becomes bigger. Uh, so in the next video part 3 I am going to explain about order, class, phylum and kingdom. Thank you so much.